the wave springs that we'll be discussing today, um, we make them in sizes from three millimeters up to over 600 millimeters. Um, for those in the inch world, that's a little under an eighth of an inch to 25 inches. Um, and if you look at that picture in the lower right, that's some of our bigger products. Some of our smaller products are to the right of the red object there, that's a pen. Um, and actually, those small wave springs are no longer even the smallest we make. Um, our current equipment can actually go smaller than the springs that are shown there. I'll now pass you on to Jimmy, who will handle the meat of today's presentation. Hi everybody, this is Jimmy. Um, so one of the advantages of a wave spring is that it's actually coiled. Um, so a coiled part is typically higher priced since each piece is coiled one at a time versus a stamping process, which can produce multiple parts at a time. What you're paying for is quality and performance since there are a number of advantages to co the coiling process. As Jay mentioned, we're vertically integrated and we roll our own flat wire in-house, so we control the quality throughout the entire production process. And since we're not cutting through the material grain, the microstructure of the material stays intact. By keeping the microstructure intact, our single-turn wave springs are able to withstand higher axial loads compared to a stamp part. The tooling for each part is matched to the wire size, which allows for quick design changes, often without any additional tooling requirements. The rolled flat wire with radius edges reduces the risk of damaging mating parts in your application and eliminates extra processes, such as tumbling or grinding to remove sharp edges. So the majority of our wave springs that we sell are either carbon or stainless steel, and we'll go over specialty materials a little later on in the presentation. Single turn wave springs with flat ends are especially useful for preloading bearings or if you have a mating surface made of a softer material. As shown at the top right, the sharp corners at the cutoff area of the san standard single turn wave spring can scratch the bearing surface as it is compressed. Over time, this can create debris, which can cause the bearing and or the application to fail. Rotor Clip's patented design with flat ends significantly reduces the amount of wear on the mating surface. This design is especially useful for wave springs with tall waves since the taller the wave, the more prone it is to digging into the mating surface. Previously, the only option to reduce wear was adding shim ends or flat coils to a multi-turn spring. So this exclusive design saves material, which means lower cost to you and less wear on the mating surface. So one of the other advantages is space savings. So we get the question all the time, why should I switch from coil springs? In many applications, wave springs can offer the same force as a coil spring while being half the height. When designing a housing or bore for a spring, it can be up to 50% shorter by using a wave spring. Secondary operations such as grinding the ends flat on a coil spring are not required. And again, we can switch from a disc spring or a Belleville washer as well, and basically they have the disc springs have a larger cross section. So if you're looking for additional clearance for shafts, wave springs save space in the radial direction while providing comparable forces. In addition to saving space, wave springs can also simplify assembly and installations, improving your quality by reducing complaints and rebuilds. Many power transmissions or fluid power systems use a stack of wave springs. The configuration requires the assembler to use the correct number of springs and install them in the correct order. The entire stack can be replaced with a single wave spring for a simpler, faster assembly process. For bearing preloading, a wave spring can replace a spring and retaining ring. And a multi-turn wave spring can be used in place of multiple coil springs in mechanical seals and clutches. For soft mating surfaces, we offer shim end wave springs, which eliminate the need to place a washer underneath the spring to protect the mating surface. It's not always necessary, but it can save you material and lower your cost. When a coil spring is compressed, it also wants to twist. So this torsional movement can wear down the mating parts over time. Wave springs help eliminate this problem since the bending load in the waves guarantees 100% axial transmission of the load.
Wave springs produce a more consistent force across a wider range of deflections. The wave spring deflection curve, shown here in red, has a wider, flatter, linear force region compared to a coil or disc spring, which are blue and green, respectively. The wave spring tolerance on spring rate and load can be up to 50% tighter than stamped wash, wave washers or disc springs. We can design a wave spring that aligns with your application's desired range of motion and load requirements. For single turn and nested multi-turn wave springs, we're targeting deflections between 30 to 70% of the free height. For multi-turn wave springs, we target deflections between 20 to 80% of the free height. And we can control the load and deflection by using different size wires, change the number of turns, the number of waves per turn, etc. A stiffer wave spring can be made simply by increasing the wire thickness and or section, or decreasing the number of turns, or increasing the number of waves per turn. Conversely, we can make a weaker wave spring by thinning out the wire thickness and section, increasing the number of turns, or decreasing the number of waves per turn. In addition to precisely controlling the loading conditions, single turn wave springs can help simplify assembly. We can alter the design to cling to the housing or the shaft. So whether you're mounting something vertically, at an angle, or overhead, the wave spring will stay in the proper position. We realize that every application has its own set of requirements and challenges, and we specialize in custom wave springs. We'll work with you from start to finish to get you the right tool for the job. This quote form is included in the WaveSpring brochure, which is available for download on this webinar. Alternatively, you can go to rotorclip.com for the digital version, which can be filled out and submitted online.